Discovery Lab here at the Mars Discovery District. The work Karen Maxwell and her team are doing has the potential to save lives. The research in my lab is focused on viruses that infect bacteria. What you're looking at here uh, is a, a plate of bacteria and where you can see the holes, that's where the these bacterial viruses have actually killed the bacteria. But Maxwell never saw herself in a leadership position. I would say in graduate school, I didn't have very many female role models. It's an obstacle still faced by women in STEM. It's important that women can see themselves. So it's important that there's representation of all genders, of all ethnicities, of all marginalized groups. Javiera Gutierrez Duran is part of U of T's Women in Science and Engineering organization, which aims to expose students to other women who have been on this STEM journey before and succeeded. It's also hard to be the person who's representing people, who's breaking the barriers. And the more women we have breaking barriers in you know, the same field, the easier it will get. It's still a smaller number in terms of faculty um, and like women versus men in faculty positions. And so it was nice, you know, it was something that I was interested in is pursuing um, a postdoctoral fellowship in a lab of uh, a successful woman scientist. I'm Karen Siolin.